What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hey guys, and welcome back. Well, uh, Cheryl Underwood got a little teary-eyed um, talking about the uh, suicide of Kate Spade. Now, she says she understands Kate Spade's daughter, Frances, is feeling following the suicide of her mother on Monday. Um, she says, I'm kind of emotional about this because, as you know, my husband killed himself. Now, a teary-eyed Underwood, 54, shared on Wednesday episode of The Talk. You will never know for people who think they know. You'll never know if it's clinical depression. You'll never know uh, what was the cause and why they took their own life. Now, uh, Kate's husband, Andy, said that she was uh, battling personal demons, depression, and anxiety. Now, Underwood then turned her comments toward 13-year-old Frances, who was named in Kate's suicide note. I'm sad for her daughter for that to be in the note because my husband left a note, Underwood added. And what the note does to the person who is still alive is it shows that the person who is no longer alive has now had the final word. Now, there's nothing you can do about it. And that pain, it doesn't go away. I really hope that the family can come together for her daughter because it just doesn't go away. Hmm. Now, Underwood and her husband, who she did not name, were married for three years when he took his own life in 1990, reports TMZ. Now, uh, she previously discussed overcoming her struggles uh, with People magazine. She said, I've been through a lot, but it's not all. Whoa, it's me. This is a journey. Everything I went through made me stronger. You may never forget it, but in remembering it, you should. it should make you a better person. For the next person. Hmm. Yeah, I did not know that uh, her husband committed suicide. I'm so sorry to uh, hear about that. And I know TMZ came out with the story that um, the note was addressed to her daughter. And she told her it's not her fault. Ask daddy. So, in saying, referencing um, her husband, um, they had speculated that um, she killed herself because he had asked for a divorce. And uh, going by what her sister said, you know, her sister was the first one to come out and talk about her mental illness and uh, uh, her family, uh, Kate's family. Uh, was outraged that her sister uh, told that publicly. and uh, But uh, she said that she tried many times to get her uh, medical attention, but she was so afraid that it was going to mark her brand and it was going to uh, have a negative effect on her that she wouldn't. So I'm sure if her husband had asked her for a divorce and in her uh, state of mind, that was just like her world was just tearing up. So, I, um, hmm. but, um, I tell you, uh, I, I'm still keeping Kate Spade family, especially her daughter in my prayers and, uh, hope you will too. And we'll keep Cheryl Underwood as well. Cause like she said that that never goes away. You're always haunted with that. Mm. All right, guys. And if you know anyone who uh, may be suicidal of hurting themselves, you know, um, call.
call the suicide prevention line and I'll have, have the number up here. All right, guys. As always, thank you for watching my video. I hope you will like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always in party, be blessed, y'all. Bye. What we do here is go back, 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 back.